it's a magnificent Pepe Yaro here. Hello, 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 hello. How's it going, everybody? Is everyone in chat okay? So this is going to be a bit of a different just chatting stream. What we're going to do is we're going to sit on the menu of the game and we're going to just hang out. Where is my controller? There it is. There we go. It says continue where I last left off, but I didn't actually... Oh my god, why is the game not in full screen? Game, please. Game. Game. I would like borderless window, please. Thank you. Press start already. Shut up. We're gonna hang out. We're just gonna. I, I don't know why it says continue where less left off. I've never played this game before, but you know, we're here to have fun, aren't we? Yeah. Well, you are. I'm not. I'm here to be miserable. Ha. <sighs> I didn't change mini pep and I didn't change the sub goal dealer. I can't start the stream until I've done mini pep and the stop sub goals. Can I? I mean, you guys are going to be distracted the entire time and everyone's going to come into chat and be like, why haven't you started mini pep yet? Why are you doing the sub kill yet? Why, why haven't you updated all the stuff you needed to updo update pepper? It's, it's going to be difficult. So obviously I need to spend about 50 or 40 minutes doing that. Um, sort of like 20 minutes, I, I don't know if any of you have been here before, but we tend to do like 20 minute intros, where I tell everyone what I've done in the, in, in the game, or like what I've done in the day, well, I, I hung out, I went to the doctors, went to see my physio, hello crow, how you doing, wow, lots of people are here to watch me play a horror game, that's not good, <laughs> Uh, I don't know why I agreed to this. This is one of those streams where, like, it seemed like a good idea at the time. You know, like, my Fall Guys stream where I was like, I'm gonna play Fall Guys until I do stuff, until I win a crown, and then I didn't win a crown for, like, four hours? Definitely one of those streams. Ah, oh, I don't want to do this. Ah. Uh, uh. You guys are gonna be here with me the entire time. I'm gonna do it normal, by the way. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna play it on easy mode. Cause I'm scoured. And, what's this game? Hey, ah! She is way too close to that camera. Hello. Go away. I love you, I love you too. I should turn I'm subtitles on. Yay. Yay. Oh, she's creepy. I don't like her face. I cannot wait to be done too close to the camera. Social distance, please. I'm not your husband. I miss you. Oh, I gotta get back to work. I love you, Ethan. Go away. You so much. Don't I care. Tons of kisses. Bye, baby. That was one kiss. I'm just saying, if you if you say you're gonna if you say you're gonna give me tons of kiss and then you do one game is a smidge quiet, I'll turn the game up in a second when I've got access to the menu. You were right. Yes, probably. I did lie to you. I shouldn't have. <laughs> All it's I okay, wife. If you get this, stay away. Understood. I'm not gonna come and get you. It's about fat. It's forty degrees Celsius. Where do you live, stranded? It's like minus three here at the moment. <laughs> We are living in very different hemispheres, Hello? clearly. Hey, Hello. It's uh, it's Ethan. Hi, right. Ethan. You all right? You oh no, I'm Ethan. Overnight. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm I'm good. Good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead. She's alive. She she's back. They found her. How? What happened? I don't know. Look, I, I don't know how, but she's back. She's back somehow. And maybe it's a prank. But she wants me to come and get her. I just do a James Sunderland. I was literally Dolby. explaining the plot Dolby to the game to M Papa. Dude, it's been three years. Um, I know, I know. Earlier today, and he was her? like, "Oh, so Silent Hill 2. I have to find out what happened. 
I mean, I guess the difference is Mia's saying stay away, and Mary in... Oh, God. Look around. Fucking look around simulator. My car is blurry. Mm, driving, yes. I drive like human. Um, Mary's, Mary's just like, come and meet me in Silent Hill. Whereas Mia's definitely like, don't come. Which I think is really rude of Ethan to then ignore. Let's say her wishes. Let me just turn the game up a little bit. So I turn the game down. And then... Where is the... Subtitles on, please. The place. There we go. Sefeflika! He assumed she was dead, I think. I mean... Yeah, but she still said stay away. So I'm just gonna say it. I would stay away. She said so. That's, that's her call. And I would stay at home and live my life. Because it's been three years. I have objectives. Find Mia, I guess. Yes, that is the objective of the game. Ooh. Oh my god. I was gonna say, why are you running? Why are you walking so slow? How do run vain? Ethan ignoring his wife's wishes, shake my head. Hey, Archie! Hello, 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 hello. How are you doing today? And yeah, I know. She literally said, stay away. Project proposal sneak into a Louisiana ghost house. Oh, we're in Louisiana. Join us. I'm okay. Accept her gift. Why don't I just go up to the house? Oh, it's locked. Okay. Playing one of my favorite series. Hope you have fun. I like Resident Evil. My favorite is 4. But I haven't played Resident Evil 7 or 8. Because I didn't like 6. Except her grift. Ah, flies. I'll just leave. I'm not gonna lie. I would love my wife if I had a wife. I would love her very much. But if she had been dead for three years, and then she comes back and she's like, Hey honey, I'm alive, but also, you know, I, I, I'm I stuck in a place, but don't come and find me. I'd be like, okay honey, I, I'm not gonna come and find you. <laughs> That's your wish. Although I think we need relationship counseling, or I need counseling. So. Ah! That's what serial killers look like. They walk in these places, and I've seen Twin Peaks. Although no one pays spoilers. For, no one's saying any spoilers for Twin Peaks because M. Papa is currently watching it. I harassed him into watching it. That looks like the kind of place you would dump a dead body. The wind minus eight degrees Celsius, that's cold. Where was that guy going? Is that a cow or a horse? I guess it's a cow. Oh, I don't like this. Average Florida Lake. Florida! That's where my American football team's from. It is a goat. It's not a goat. That's not a goat. I'm sorry. I've seen goats. Goats are not that big. Like, look. Let's, let's have a look. Let's really investigate this dead goat. That is... That's, that's a cow. That's a bull. There are no goats that are that big. And look at the size of these legs. You need these chainsaw blades to get them off. Also, goats don't have horns like that. That's a bull. It's many animal. We have weird temp down here. 
Yeah, I guess because Sif Eflik has quite, like, desert-y, but also, like, there are some mountains there, isn't there? So, you get all the temperatures. God, this game looks so sepia-toned. Again, I would leave. Love my wife, not this much. Don't love my wife this much. It, it's a bag. Is that my wife? Is that my... Look, let me... I should get really close. I only recognize my wife when she's real close to me. Oh, it's Mia's driving license. Okay. I was gonna say, unless she's like in my face going, hi baby! I don't recognize her at all. I've seen her for three seconds. <clears throat> nope. Nope, I don't love my wife this much. I don't think anyone loves their wife this much. Chat, would you, if your wife was stuck in here, say, say I'm your wife for fun's sake. Yeah? Say I'm your wife and I'm stuck in this house. Would you go in this house to get me? No, you wouldn't. You would go back and you call the police. You definitely wouldn't, you know, go into the clear murder house. I'm insane enough to try it. We could hang out on the love seat together. Look. I wouldn't even come to the state. I love you, but now, yeah, no, you wouldn't even go to Louisiana. <laughs> I'd go if I barely know you. You guys are crazy. You guys are crazy. There is no one on this planet. I love my cats. Yeah. I wouldn't even go in this fucking house for my cats. Yeah. I'd look in this house and I'd think to myself, there's loads of cats in the cat shelter. <laughs> There are loads of cats in the cat show. I like, I love Tuna and Apollo. There will be other cats. <laughs> oh my god, that's so horrible to say. <laughs> oh. I just, oh, this place sucks. Oh yeah. Glad we got some bleach here. I will say, I thought my washing machine was blowing up. So I had a friend over. Um, I was doing some chores and just hanging out with them. And I thought my washing machine <laughs> I thought my washing machine was blowing up because I suddenly heard like a dung 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 dung. What had actually happened, I didn't know this, was that my washing machine had come away from the wall and was like just bouncing around my kitchen. <clears throat> my first reaction was to grab Tuna and Apollo and run out of the house. I left my friend in there. <laughs> I just completely left my friend in the house. I was like, nope, <laughs> if the washing machine is going to explode, I am not staying in there. <laughs> Doesn't every village have a murder house? I had a village. No, I'm not in a village. <laughs> well, yeah, but like, they're my cats. If I could have scooped up my fish at the same time, I would have done that too. Um. Ugh. Ugh. Did I have to make this house pitch black? Oh my, oh my god, no. Chat, why are you making me play this game? Ah! No, there's so much stuff that could be hiding in this house. Ah! <sighs> I've already established I wouldn't go in this house for my pets either. When I was living in London, there was a house that looked like this uh, on my way to school. But it had like red paint on the outside and someone had painted like a load of conspiracy theory stuff and like murder stuff basically outside the house. Looked very weird. There was red tubes coming out of the house and everything. I have no idea to this day what that... Ah! What was that? 
Oh, God, I hate this. Oh, I hate this. Oh, no, don't like this at all. I don't know how much I can play with this game. <laughs> I genuinely don't. Oh, no. 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 Clean your house. Not even my house looks this bad. Oh, cockroaches. I can't stand cockroaches. I didn't know they could fly until recently, and now I know they can fly. I'm just like, nope. Oh no, Yahavi! Ah! Fuck! Fuck! Yeah, Moon. Oh. Yahavi. No. 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 <laughs> you just wouldn't go into this house. You just wouldn't go into this house. You know what? You wouldn't. You wouldn't. No one would go into this house. Over 20 missing in two years? Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. I'm not looking. Ah. 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 Uh, who wants to play house flipper? That's a crow. <laughs> oh, you don't want to eat crows. Ah. Uh, does the wall work? Oh, I stopped the wall. Oh, why is the house creaking? Why is the house creaking? What is that? Oh, it's a creepy picture of someone. Cool. Glad, glad I saw that. Glad that's in my brain now. Oh, fuck's sake. How's Pep? Pep's not good. Pep's not doing well. I don't know if I can do two hours of this game. <laughs> I'm okay. I have to be really real with you, chat. I'm so bad with horror. It really freaks me out. I don't know why I agreed to this. It's probably because chat kept asking me to play this game, but I am so bad with horror. I've got like a vivid imagination and like very vivid dreams. And so I stay away from anything that will give me this kind of creepy imagery in my brain because I'm gonna not sleep tonight and I'm so tired. <sighs> Hi dude. I hate jump scare. Yeah, that's the thing. I can play Silent Hill. That's one of the only horror games I can Fuck off! Shut up, house. I'm trying to talk. I'm trying to stream. I can play Silent Hill because like I know there's not really jump scary streams uh scenes in Silent Hill. Oh god, oh god, everything in this house sucks! Oh, you just know that, like... Oh, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this! Don't open the door! This one is a good one, yeah? Yeah? What part of this is good so far? Ah, oh, no! Oh no, not a screen. I've, this is basically Silent Hill 2. I'm just saying. This is an actual room in Silent Hill 2. There is an, a, a real room in Silent Hill 2 that looks like this, I'm just saying. Is that my wife? You gotta follow my wife? Is that wife? Yeah, see everyone who's played Silent Hill will know exactly what room I'm talking about. That is this room. Is that my wife's feet? <laughs> ah! Shut up! Game. Oh, there's a fuse missing. Well, I could have told you that. I could have told you there was a fuse missing. Faux show. Sure. Get to play some music. Oh! Oh, this house sucks. This house sucks so much. Oh, I hate this house. You wouldn't live here. No one would live here. Oh, that's good. Oop. Ever play fit? No. <laughs> it's Mario 64 again. It might have to be Mario 64 again in that I might have to pivot to another game if I get too freaked out. I got offered to wear a heartbeat monitor for this stream and I said no because I didn't want you all to know how freaked out I actually am right now. What is this photo supposed to show? Just as a genuine question. What is this photo supposed to show me? 
there's a door in a prison. Like, who, who took this photo and why? Oh, I don't want to watch the TV. It looks like the owners. You can't tell that. They might just be random photos. I've got a stock photo picture of a baby that I don't know in my house. <laughs> I should probably explain that one. <clears throat> I... We're in the age of people posting everything to Instagram. Are you shocked? I mean, kind of. I wanted to play piano. And turn on a light. Wait, why? Okay, I'll, I'll explain the stock photo picture of the baby. I bought... Was it, was it something I bought or was it something I won in a Christmas cracker? Either way, I have this tiny, tiny picture frame. And it had a stock photo of a baby in it. And I never printed out a photo to put in there. I was going to like put a photo of like me and my grandmother or something. Because I've got loads of pictures of me and my... Ah, go away! I'm trying to tell a story. I got loads of photos of... Um, photos of my nan and stuff. Like I really get... I'm really close with my nan. So I was like, I'll take a photo. I'll get a photo of me and my nan printed out and stuff. And put it into the picture frame. But then I kind of just didn't do that. And then what ended up happening instead is I've just attached to the picture of the stock photo of the baby now. It's kind of a joke in my house. So <laughs> I just kept it. And now I'm like, oh my god, I have to find a video to put in here? Oh no. Yamate kuda, stop, please. What is this a photo of? Who has a photo like this in their house? Oh god. Ugh. I have to find a video. I have to find a video. Is it in this room or do I have to go somewhere else? I bet you I have to go somewhere else. I don't want to go somewhere else. Give the baby a name? I think that would be too weird for me. Oh my god. Seriously, Ethan, get a better flashlight. Oh, my heart is pumping. <laughs> my heart is just like, no, we're not going to do this. If I get to an hour and I'm really freaked out, I'll swap over to something else. We'll play House Flipper. <laughs> In honor of this, we'll play House Flipper. <laughs> oh man. What is in here? Oh, that's just a drawer of goo. If you won't name the child, the baby is now Leslie. I mean, that's fine. The baby can be Leslie. Oh, cool. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. I feel like the, the floor is going to give out on me or something. What's this? Okay, saved it. Oh, yes. <sighs> and I found the cassette tape. Cool. An hour is a good metric with this game. Yeah. I get to watch the thing live. Oh, it's it's not good. See, I've watched people play this game before. I've watched people play Bioshock. Uh, Bioshock. Not Bioshock. Bioshock would be fun. I'd love to play Bioshock. Chat, can I install Bioshock, please? Oh, 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 that creeped me out. That's just Ethan. Ethan! No fuse? Do I need the fuse? Where is the fuse, actually? There's, like, nothing in this house where I could find a fuse, right? Do I come back to this house at some point? Or is this just the house I'm at? Like, because it's, like, locked stuff. Do you have Bioshock? I do have Bioshock. Bioshock's one of my favorite games of all time. I got Bioshock. Ah! I think something's in this room, but... Oh, that scared me. That was my phone letting me know Twitter had gone off. Okay. I'm a horror freak. Oh. 
Why? Why would you do this to yourself? Bioshock 1 is art by Loki. For twos? Twos? I thought you were going to say infinite. Infinite is the other correct answer. Two is not a correct answer with Bioshock. Oh, I don't want to watch this tape. Whatever's on this tape doesn't need to be seen. Ah! Testing. No, you people are wrong about Bioshock. Oops. Ah! <gasps> Fucking piss off, mate! Did you find this guy? Give me a break, Pete. Hey, I only work with professionals. Seriously, can people stop Pete looking into cameras and being like, hey! Sound is right this time. I don't want a repeat of Amarillo. That was two fucking years ago. I don't do ADR. Have fun, Stranded. This new guy? I'm not feeling it. Again? Just don't be surprised if we have to make a change. I come off British when I, when I get scared. I'm yet more British. I'm like, piss we'll off! The first, then we shoot the intro, just like we always. Do. Is this your first walkthrough of the game? Yes. Yeah. Show's name this time, okay? No problem. We do that as VTubers, but I don't go real close Another to the camera like that. Shithole. Could you imagine if I started my stream and just like, boom? No, no, I will watch that. Who starts their streams with that? Ah. Uh, just don't go in the house. Just don't go in the house. Are we rolling? Yes. All right, let's go. <clears throat> Get out of the way. It's locked. Hmm. After you. Fuck off. So, You're all terrible people. Why are we in hell this time? Do you ever prep? What's the prep? Shitty house, spooky sounds. Ooh, is it haunted? This is not the be this is not the YouTuber energy we Fuck need. Me. I was an anchor, you know. Oh well. You can sub, Pete. Not anchor. What's that? Nothing. You weren't an anchor. You were a substitute on the weekend. That's what he said. You should Story, listen more. Andre. Abandoned farmhouse, missing family, foul play suspected. The so usual. basically, the exact same thing that he was saying. How long do you say this place has been abandoned? Three years. Clancy, get a shot of this. No. Let's make a great cutaway. A Michael Clancy. So, uh, Hillbilly Joe and his family go missing. Not Hillbillies, the Bakers. Jack and Marguerite Baker. And they were quiet, not backward. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. Ah, shit. I know I should have worn my good shoes. Why would you wear your good shoes? Oh, shit. I think it's because Ken job. Levine doesn't work for 2K anymore. I'm pretty sure Hold he's on. releasing his own game now. Just make a great backdrop. Baker's their food looks pretty Andre, bad. It looks really awful. Think? I think you look like a dickhead. Andre? Yeah, where is Andre? Andre! 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 Andre, what the Did fuck, I man? Where Andre went? No. I think we should leave. Where is he? Unfucking believable. This is the last time I work with that guy. Sure. I mean, producers, they come and go, but a, a good cameraman like you, Clancy, you stick with me. What else am I supposed to do, man? Yes, I would head out. Are you kidding me? Why would I stay? What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? Nope. Andre? Where the fuck is he? You tell me. I'd like to leave now. Andre, where are you, man? I would like to leave now. Like, seriously, how did Andre actually disappear that quickly? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Alright, new deal. Yeah? 
We, we find Andre and we go. I mean, fuck this show. I'm with you. I'm not even on the find Andre train. I'm on the go train. I'm on the goodbye train. Too bad you aren't playing it in VR. I can barely play it in normal. Why would I ever want to subject myself to this in VR? Oh, shit. How do I crouch? There we go. Hey, dickwad. What are you doing? You first. Oh, fuck off. Need a nice hero shot of me coming down the ladder. Yeah, no. Yeah, so, uh, good. You first. Absolutely not. How about you go? I would have died when Mia popped up and said, Hi, honey! Or whatever she said. Off you go, mate. Off you go. Off you go. Off you go. I don't want to go down here. I've seen the Blair Witch Project. Oh. What do you see? Oh, no. I have seen the Blair Witch Project. No. No, 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 I'm coming back up this fucking ladder. Fuck off. No. Andre's down there. Oh my god, no, the game's gonna make me do this. Andre's down here. You should come down here now. Please. I found Andre. Your bestie is here. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Andre! Hi, baby! Hi, babe! Ah, oh, no! Oh, Andre. That's not what you want. 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 No, 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 no. <sighs> It's almost like say bro. Bro. <laughs> Imagine getting killed by some bro. Bro. <laughs> Jesus. Yes. Not probably not. Oh my god, how do I get out of here? Can I leave now? Can I leave? I would like to leave. Wait, do I have to go? Oh, no, I have to go in the hatch, don't I? Oh, this house sucks. Everything about this house sucks. Bro, did you... <laughs> pretty cringe, not gonna lie. NGL. Pretty cringe, Andre. Oh, man. Why would you do this, Ethan? Nobody is worth this. There are many Mias in the world. It's a very common name. Oh man, no. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. No cockroaches! No, oh, this video would never get monetized because I'm just swearing so much. But seriously, Andre can die for all I care. Andre is dead, actually. Andre is very dead. Oh, good. Ethan, man. Ethan, Ethan, you suck! Damn it. Oh, Ethan. That's that's definitely body parts in it. Oh, those are definitely body parts. Those are like heads or something. This is where Andre was hanging out. You want to Blair Witch it, Ethan? You want to just hang out on that pipe, Ethan? Probably. If you thought Mia was on that pipe, you'd probably hang out on that pipe. Ethan, you have problems, okay? I think you have a codependent relationship with your wife. I think the last three years have been really tough, but I think you should go to therapy. You know, just hang out, be good, be good for you. Then you know what? Even if Mia comes back, you're a healthier person for it, yeah? This hatred for Ethan. It's not a hatred. I think Ethan has problems. Like, oh, no. Whatever that was can fuck off. No, no, not today. It does not. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not mad at Ethan. But I think he's- ah! uh, uh, Can I play House Flipper yet? 
<laughs> I would like to play House Flipper now. Oh, oh, it's the it's it's the place. It's the the door that we took a photo of. Cool, very cool. Oh, I, I would rather have played Final Fantasy VIII. I don't know why I said Final Fantasy VIII. I'd rather have yeah. played Resident Evil. Mia, Mia, hey Mia. Um, I need to open this door. Mia's Mia's here. Hey Mia. What are you taking up Far Fantasy? Yeah, I meant Resident Evil 8. Okay. M Mira, Ethan's here and he has bolt cutters. I'm not gonna lie. Ben, dead. Harold, turned. Arthur, turned. Tamara, dead. Craig, a uh, turn, sorry. Craig, dead. Layla, dead. Sean, dead. William, dead. Travis, turned. Arthur, dead. Andre, dead. Clancy, that's me. Or was me. Clancy L plus ratio. Mia undetermined. Heidi turned. Clyde dead. Lindsay turned. Stephen turned. Nathaniel dead. Edward dead. Nadine dead. Alex dead. Tom dead. Ray Reed turned. Susan turned. Joseph dead. And is that David? David dead. Uh, I'm not beyond, like, just reading out lists of words just to fill for time, by the way. I accept that's what I just did, and that's what I'll continue to do. Ethan <laughs> forcefully excluded from house. Hey, Mia! Time to go home. Mia, Mia, Mia. Hey, babe! God, I, found you. I don't know if I would know my wife just from behind yeah. if I hadn't seen right. her for three years. You shouldn't be here. This is correct. What do you mean? You contacted me. No, no, I wouldn't. Did I? I don't know. Did anyone see you? You have Did crazy he eyes. He, who else is here? What the hell's going on? Daddy's coming. We need to go. Daddy? We need I'm to go Daddy, now. aren't I? Can I be daddy, Ethan? Like Mia? <laughs> I would like to be. Where are you taking? You're very pretty, Mia. Someplace safe. Are you wearing makeup? What's going on? <laughs> you wearing makeup? Baby, you've been gone for three years. Three years. When did you put makeup on? Has it really been three years? Where did you put makeup on? Who is giving you makeup? Mia, what are we doing? 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 What are we doing? Mia? Yeah, I just, I don't think she's into you. What is this place? What they do to you? Booty. Not now. Okay. We need to get out of here first. Okay. I think it's this way. Okay. I thought we were crouching. I didn't mean to look at your butt. If you don't want me to look at your butt, I'm not going to. You seem very upset. Okay, Mia. Do you have a headache? Do you want some paracetamol? Mia, we have to talk. Not, Not here, me. Ethan. Not me. That wasn't me. But you did. I didn't. Okay, fine. Just tell me what's going on. I'm telling you everything that I know. Cool. We have to go this way. She's right, though, Ethan. You have chosen a terrible time to talk about this. I really think that perhaps you could have chosen a bad time. Hold on a sec. Is there something in here? Okay. Mia. Mia. Are you sure you know where you're going? Family used to bring me food through here. Okay. I remember. Okay. Graceful, Ethan. Hey Mia, do you mind if I turn the game yeah. brightness up? It's there. 
Cool. I'm glad it's here. This is it. Okay. I remember this room. Good. There's another door here. I'm sure of it. Yep. It's not here. It's gone. It's gone. All right, Mia. We can find another way out. We're going to be a family. I swim here. Now that you're here. No, we're not. There's another door here. I'm sure of it. Hey, Mia. Hey, Mia. You maybe want to swim? How good are you at swimming, Mia? Mia. We got to get out of here. We do. I agree. Just stay here, all right? I'm going to have a look around. Yeah, stay here, Mia. I'm going to look for stuff. I'm going to look for the things, Mia. There's this. E001. That's, that's cool. Do you know this woman? Her name is you. You. Hi, that man. Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to the stream. How you doing today? No worries, stranded. Oh, you can fuck off with your creepy dolls, mate. That is not okay. Oh, it's Mia. Uh. <laughs> ah! Mia. Mia. Hey, Mia. Mia. How you doing? What are you up to, Mia? Mia? Okay, the phone's not working. Mia. Guest house map. Cool. Um, um. Is that a locked room? Hey, Mia. You came to put your makeup on? Is that what you're doing? Fuck off! No, 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 no. Chat. No worries. Have a good time, stranded. Thank you for joining me for the stream. How much more do I have to play? Serious answers only, please. Uh. Oh. Let me just. You said an hour at half nine. I am not doing an hour at half nine. I am not playing another half an hour of this game. Thank you, dead man. Thank you for the subscription. Wink. Oh, that wasn't a wink. Oh, I forgot I turned off winking. I'm sorry that you have a wildfire stranded. I hope that everyone stays safe. Make sure you look after yourself. Make sure if you find any creepy houses that look like that, you definitely don't go in them. Try narrating the game in the style of David Amber. I don't think that'll help. Uh, I don't think I help. Uh, I just don't like the banging. I really don't like the banging. No, I'm not doing 40 more minutes. Absolutely not, Lauren. Absolutely not. That is not happening. I'm struggling. I'm struggling, chat. I'm so freaked out. And I had something planned in case I could do it. 
I don't like the knocking. I don't like the game. It's gross. Where I'm at, it's almost three feet of snow. I want to be where you're at, dead man. I want snow. You've got 40 minutes. No. I've just realized, Lauren, I'm in charge of the stream. I've never played Bayonetta. Is Bayonetta good? Paused until you keep playing. I'm just, I'm thinking, let me cook. Let me cook, Lauren. I'm trying to work out my options because I'm really struggling. <laughs> uh, Midwest. Oh, American Midwest. What's American Midwest? So, like, uh, never eat shredded wheat. So, we're talking like. Thirty more minutes. Actually, Lauren, I just realized I'm in control of the stream. It's my stream. I get to do whatever. I don't. I get to do whatever I want. <laughs> Biting time. I am. Yes. I don't like the knocking. It's freaking me out. If only because I live in a house where things knock like that. Like my neighbors knock on their walls like that all the time. And so if I start thinking that there are murderers in my next door neighbor's house, I will start freaking out. You're close to the end of the prologue. Oh, don't say that. Don't say that. Oh. How much creepier does it get from here? That's my main question. To be fair, the worst your neighbors will do is hoover your place. Who knows? Great. Good answer. It gets good. It's not good yet. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Honestly, it becomes a bit more action. You find a gun. Uh, it's okay in night time since New, Me New Mexico. Okay, does New, does New Mexico count as Midwest? I thought it was like Southern. I don't know why I thought New Mexico was that above or next to Texas. Turn the game down. I'll mute the game. I'll just take my headphones off. I, I, look, headphones are off. Ugh, Southwest. I, oh, the game is much easier when I'm like. Is it this door? That's locked. Why not before? Uh, wasn't like, why didn't I take my headphones off before? I don't know. It's probably because I feel really weird streaming without headphones on. I've, I've said this before, but whenever I start my stream, I expect chat to respond to me when I say hello. Whenever I start my stream, I sit there and that's why I do the... Now I just do the face because I... I, I do the face. I don't know why. Um, but I always expect chat to respond. Turn it down. You may kind of need headphones. I don't need headphones on. I don't need them. Wait, so I literally can only go to the bathroom and back down to the basement. Ugh. I got subtitles. That should be good. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't want to go down here. I don't want to go down here, chat. So, like, I don't know. I feel weird streaming without headphones on. He yeah, you see? This is a hell no situation. Thank you. This is a situation where you look down these stairs and you go, No, I'm not going down here. Oh, man. He's walking so slow. Oh, Ethan. Ethan. Ethan! Oh, no. Hi, Mia. Mia. No! No, oh, Mia, no. Mia, go away. I think we should see other people. I definitely think we should see other people. Oh, my God, Mia. Are you coming at me with a knife? A That's a knife. That's a knife. Mia? Mia? Wait. 
Wait. I'm just gonna say, I'm just gonna say, Ethan, I don't think saying wait is like gonna help. Mia, Mia, your makeup, Mia. Have you changed the way you look? Ow. Ow. Mia. I think we should talk about her. our problems. I can feel she doesn't look happy now. Way back inside of me. Get out! Leave me alone! I still kind of hear the game. I, I put my headphones on the arm of my chair. I deserve this. I don't know if anyone deserves this meal. Hey, honey. You're good, you? honey. What the fuck are you? Who the fuck are you, I think, would be the, uh... Uh, yeah, let me use a first aid kit. Let me... Oh, yes, that's how first aid works. You just get some water, you pour it on yourself. All gone. Um... Like, do I have to... Hey, honey. Oh, no! That's what demons do. <laughs> I would love to leave you, Mia. Okay. Okay, Mia. I I can tell you are you are having we're having some difficulties right now. I think we can talk about it. I can never leave. I'm just saying. I think the I think the point at which you are attacking each other with a machete and an axe might be the point where communication has broken down. Oh no! I love you, Mia. Think we should see other people, Mia? Think maybe we should. Just think that maybe. Hey, Mia? Thanks for opening this door for me, though. It's very, it was very nice of you. Um, are you okay? Are you good? Do you want some magic? You want some magic juice, Mia? Will that make you feel any better? I've got magic juice. You want magic juice, Mia? I guess not. You just, you, you stay tight. Oh, ring. Come here. I'm starting to get that impression. And what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. You should have a good day, Crow. Attic. Go there. Now. Head to the attic. Is that this way? Hey Mia, me. Where's Mia? Mia? I'm fucking taking the axe. I'm not taking any chances. My wife is having a difficult time adjusting to the new relationship dynamic we have where I am a sane person and she is a crazy person. And you know what? It's it's a hard time in anyone's marriage, where you know. Where is the attic? Ethan's just coping, coping pretty well, I think, with the, all things considered. How do I get up? How does one ascend to the attic?
Man, these co corridors are just so dark and I hate them. Wish I could help, but here I am eating a dip deep dish pizza. That's cool. We've all got our own things going on in life. I really want to know where Mia's gone. Three more special, special juice. We got special juice anywhere? There we go. These have an axe. There is always that. I keep an axe in case my wife shows up. Am I right, guys? Da dun dun. Oh, I guess she went this way. Mia! Probably not in this room. Do I need to find the fuse? Must I find fuse? I have an axe. I think I can get through any door. Are you winning, Bunny? No. No. My wife is having some difficulties adjusting to our new relationship paradigm. And I don't know where to go. It says head to the attic, but like, how do you go to the attic? Like... There's the basement. Take care, dude. Have a good day. Check the TV room. I guess we get Ethan can kind of half sprint. I leave that door open. Uh, no, all the way open, please, Ethan. Thank you. I feel like I've checked the TV room pretty well. I feel like <laughs> so mega charge is not even close to being said. Uh, Macro, you've only just shown up, right? No. What? One no. One no. Have I done something wrong? <clears throat> yeah, but like, where is the stairs one? I need the fuse, but I don't know where the fuse is. I was so scared for a moment. But I trust you're being super cool. Oh, I am not. <laughs> when in doubt, Peppa hit with an axe? Okay.
That doesn't seem to be fixing anything. Instructions unclear. Hit myself with an axe. Fuse is. I can try and give you a shit clue. Why don't you just tell me where it is? <laughs> She's not using headphones. I am not. Kitchen, use the bolt cars. Kitchen. Oh, I hadn't even gone back to the kitchen. Oh, it says that the key's there. Okay. Three hundred IQ move. It is a little. I'm just saying. Spooky game is way less scary when you can't hear it. Use the bolt cuts. What? Ah, Naruto. Oh, oh, no. Why Santa hat and the key? There we go. Why would you lock up your own fuse? That doesn't really make sense to me. Shame on you, Chad. I expected more from you. Did you? I told everyone I didn't want to play this game. And then I told everyone I didn't do horror games. And then I told everyone I hoped this was going to be my first and only horror stream. I feel like I gave Chad every expectation that I wasn't going to be dealing with this very well. Alright, so now I go upstairs and I press the big button. It's okay. Oh my god! It's okay. Mia, didn't mean to hurt me. stop doing that and just say hi like a normal person, please. Mia! Alright, I shouldn't have hit you in the neck with an axe, but I think you're overreacting a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. I don't think you really appreciate the effort that I took to come all the way to Louisiana. I'm just saying. Also, Mia. Mia, that's a chainsaw, Mia. Put the chainsaw down, Mia. Oh god. Oh, that's 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 definitely think. Oh no. I have no hand. You know, Mia, you should always finish the job and kill people. I'm just saying. It's polite. Oh, I got a bleedy stub. I'm gonna keep going upstairs though, Mia. I'm just saying. I'm also gonna save the game, Mia. What did I just... Ah! I understand now. But yeah, Mia, I, I just... I, I don't think this is gonna work out. You cut my hand off, Mia. Oh, hell yeah. Mia, honey, do you wanna talk now? Okay, fine. Mia! I'm ready to have a conversation now, Mia. Is 
If that's okay with you, Mia. Think we should talk. About how I have a gun. And you have a chainsaw. Oh, this doesn't look good. Can I, can I stop playing now? <laughs> I don't feel bad with the gun, by the way. I just feel worse. Because <laughs> I feel like she's going to come after me now with a chainsaw, and I'd really rather she didn't. And I really hurt my throat when I screamed because that was a proper scream. And she scared me. And she gave me a spoop. And I, I'm being very loud and it's very late at night. You know, my neighbors are going to be like, you know, you can't scream late at night. Because it's bad for the 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 for Leslie Aww. I have played over an hour I have no objection to change you have been a brave bun and done well thank you thank you <laughs> chat have voted we're gonna have a changeover chat we're gonna play a different game because I'm spooked out. Who wants to play Animal Crossing? <laughs> uh, let me find a game. But an hour is in 20 minutes. Shut up. We're not having this conversation again. Uh, oh, that's not supposed to be there. Now let me just. Oops. Chat, let me grab your link. Oh, here I am. Let me put my headphones back on chat. Let me find a game. Have you played Bioshock? I have played Bioshock. Bioshock's one of my favorite games. Bioshock's very good. Ah, I screamed really loudly. <laughs> That's why I was like, okay, okay. It's past 10 o'clock at night, and that was a very loud scream. So I'm gonna change the video games. What do I have installed? I have, I have lots installed. What do I have on thingy? What do I have on, have you played Hellsinger? What, Metal Hellsinger? You mean the rhythm game that goes dunk, 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 dunk. I haven't actually. Let me make myself bigger. There we go. Try and find like Big Pep. Yes, Big Pep indeed. And try and find something chill enough, but cool enough. More? If I do more, I'll take it. Well, I guess I won't. Am I in front of chat? Yeah, I'm in front of chat. If I do more, I'll get in front of chat. But how have you been? Oh my god. Chat, just so you know, you can find love in my chat. <laughs> the bots are here to help. Chat, I think you, sh you should all donate like 500 pounds to me so I can play Genshin. <laughs> uh, I wonder if there are Genshin streamers that are like that, that are like, Chat, I will roll for stuff, but only if you purchase them. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be awful. What 
What are they playing on Saturday? They do bait money? Wait, really? I've never watched a Genshin streamer, so I didn't know that was a thing. They actually bait money? That's a little bit crazy. And concerning. I can't imagine ever being like, chat, if you want me to do this thing, you gotta pay me. Not all, but some is pretty blatant. Jeez. Alright, alright, alright. I need to quickly change my thumbnail and video title. Chat, let's hang out. Let's, let's, let's talk about us, baby. Let's talk about us and me. Uh... Should I just make a really quick thumbnail? <laughs> How quick can I make a thumbnail? Speed run, let's go. Uh, so what has everyone been doing? What's everyone doing this weekend? I guess that's a good question. Everyone just talk amongst yourselves about your weekend plans, please. Well, I quickly make a thumbnail. That is my emails. I'm really glad I'm not sharing this, stream, this screen right now. <laughs> Hopefully recovering. <laughs> Finally recovering. You've been sick? Kanako, you gotta look after yourself more. Oh man, I am like nearly done with this uh, thumbnail. I'm gonna play one of my favorite games ever and I know that I can't finish it on stream but gosh darn am I just gonna play it anyway. Because I've got it installed and I might as well. Let's go! Thumbnail simulator. I kind of hate that you have to do this on YouTube. You don't have to, but you kind of do. It's strongly recommended by YouTube that you make a thumbnail for everything. Broken sleep? Oh, I'm really sorry to hear that. This is the worst thumbnail I think I've ever made. It's a good thing I'm like an expert at making them now. I should have made a, a backup thumbnail with this game just in case because I knew I wanted to play it at some point probably didn't want to play it on stream because I'll get in trouble for playing on stream but uh, I thought hey screw it uh, let's save this let's export this as Jabug true There we go. Thumbnail! And I will tell you what game I'm playing now as well. What is that from? Right, game change. This is a real game changer for us, chat. I need to make myself small again. How does that look on this? It probably will look fine. There right. okay, I need to budge over a little bit. But it looks fine. Oh, I wonder what it is. <laughs> 
Everyone in chat is- everyone in my Discord is gonna be like, Really, Peppa? You said you weren't gonna play this. Peppa, you promised- You promised you weren't gonna play this game! I lied. I'm probably gonna have to do window capture on this. Oh, hell yeah. Or not. Really? Really? That is not what I want. That is the wrong thing. One moment, chat. There we go. Yeah, no, this is like, ah. Oh. Just so you know, I've barely ever changed the game midstream, and I've never gone through this ever. <laughs> but in my mind, I'm like, I've wanted to play for some through portable all day, and I've had like stuff that I needed to get done all day, and I couldn't do it. And I was like, we've got to pivot. <laughs> and I gotta make it an interesting pivot. And it's gonna last a while. <laughs> then guess what we're doing? Oh, really? Really? Ah, oh, there we go. This is now our six hour stream. <laughs> At least. In this game, you can select the gender of your main character. The course of the game will change based on the character's gender. Yes, it will. By choosing a male character, you'll be able to male main character. You'll be able to play a version of very close to the original Persona 3. This is recommended for new players. I'm not a new player. <laughs> you only stream up to a point, right? Yeah, in December. <laughs> uh, the female main character added to this game is not just for female players. This is true. She's also a vet for veterans of Persona 3 and P3S who want a new perspective. Now please choose a gender. I will be the girl because she's my favorite main character of all Persona. Yes. We're going to go for easy because, you know. Oh, background music. There we go. Because always sometimes I get stuck in really irritating parts and I think that'll be boring for stream. <laughs> if I'm just stuck in really difficult bits. Because the game is a little bit unfair in places. Plus I normally play like story based games. Time never waits. It delivers us all equally to the same end. You who wish to save out the future, however limited it may be, you will be given one year. Go forth without falter. With your heart as your guide. Yay! I will say this game doesn't have the cutscenes of Persona 3. So if you're really in it for the animated cutscenes, this is not the game for you. But it is better in basically every single way. And I stand by that claim. It's got glimpses of it. Terminal station entrance. Oh, I love this game so much. See, entrance is buzzing with activity. Meanwhile, elsewhere. I just put it to my head. Yep. Pull the trigger. Yep. Now chickening out. I'm gonna have to turn the game down at some point, but you know. I could do it myself. There we go. <laughs> No, I can't. 
Iwatodai. <laughs> I don't know why I've always liked the way that guy says Iwatodai. Worst character right there? What, the train driver? Iwatodai. Well, though. It's almost midnight. Spooky. See, it's still a spooky game. Something odd about the atmosphere. It would probably be best to hurry to the dorm. This is true. As you walk from the station, you notice coffin-like objects lining the deserted cities. Spooky! I'll still pretend it's a horror game. <gasps> ah! It's an eerily gigantic moon. Gekukan High School, Iwatodai Dorm. This is the dorm men you mentioned in your admission pamphlet. I have so many questions about this moment. <laughs> Hello. You're late. A little bit. Been waiting a long time. Okay. See, he's a little bit creepy. If you want to proceed, then please sign here. It's a contract. Good there's to know. No need to be scared. I hate it when people say things like, there's no need to be scared, in situations where there is clearly a need to be scared. It only binds you to accepting full responsibility for your actions. You know, like a contract. I will choose if this fate of mine own free will. Below it is a blank to sign your name. I think it should say blank space. Enter your first name. Pepperoni! Peeper. Yaro. Proceed. Yes. Very well. Time is something no one can escape. It delivers us all to the same end. Wishing won't make it go away. And so it begins. Cool story, bro. The unknown boy disappeared as if melting into the darkness. Who's there? Hi. How can you be? But it's... I am a magician, yes. Don't tell me. No, I am. Like Penn and Teller. Houdini. Wait. Just gonna say, Yukari was full ready to shoot me there. <laughs> she was like, I'm gonna shoot the fuck out of you. I didn't think you'd arrive so late. My name is Mitsuru Kirijo. I'm one of the students who live in the storm. Oh, look, best girl. Who's she? She's definitely best girl in the game. A transfer student. I am. A last minute decision to assign her here. She'll eventually be moved to a room in the normal dorm. You don't think. You don't know that. Is it okay for her to be here? I guess we'll see. This is Yukari Takeba. She was gonna shoot you. She'll be a junior this spring, just like you. Hi, I'm Yukari. Hi, Yukari. Why do you have a gun? <laughs> um, well... It's sort of like a hobby. Ah, yes, the hobby of having a gun. Well, not a hobby. <laughs> oh, I guess America. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just dragging Americans right now. It's for self defense. It's not a real gun, of course. Of course. It's getting late. You'll find your room on the third floor. Do you know, like, three doors down from the Hello Kitty cafe that I went to last week? 
is also randomly a gun shop. We don't have many gun shops in the UK, so it's very odd to just see guns on display. Just walking past, and I just looked over, I was like, huh. <laughs> Your thing should already be there. I suggest you tuck in for the night. Oh, I'll show you the way. Follow me. Very tense music. Very Ace Attorney. This is it. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's right at the end of the hall. So, any questions? Huh? I signed a contract. What's this about a contract? Um, can I ask you something? Yes. On your way here from the station, was everything okay? Yes. You know what I... Never mind. It seems like you're alright. Well, I better get going. Have fun, Yukari. Bye, Yukari. Um, I'm sure you still have other questions. I do. We'll Many. Them for later, okay? Good night. Night. I can't tell you how many times I've played this game, chat. I really can't. I'm like seeing you like, oh wow, how many times have I played this game? Make sure that's okay still, yeah. That looks fine. So I should explain the cursor thing. Most Persona games don't actually look like this. This is just because in Persona 3, uh, Portable, this was made for the PSP. So you couldn't just have, they couldn't animate like a character running around the rooms and stuff, the, the PSP just didn't have the power, so that we've got this cursor. And you just kind of have to imagine that the main character, best girl, is walking around places. She's got that VTuber angle on the screen though, she's like... <laughs> she's looking good. It's Yukari. Are you awake? No. Good morning. Did you sleep okay? Mitsuru I dreamt you had a gun. Are you ready to go? Totally. Okay, then let's go. We have to take the monorail to get there. Bet your last school wasn't like that, huh? You don't know what my last school is like, Yukari. This is my favorite part, when it feels like you're gliding over the sea. Our stop is Port Island Station at the end of the line. From there, we walk. The have the you ever man. heard of Tatsumi Port Island? It's a man-made island. I'm here, aren't I? They built our school right in the middle. Oh, look, you can see it now. Were you expelled? No, you weren't expelled. <laughs> it's not Persona 5. <laughs> you weren't expelled randomly. Morning. 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 Well, here we are. Welcome to Gekukon High. You're gonna love it here. You can't promise me that, Yukari. You're okay from here, right? You should go see your homeroom teacher first. The faculty office is right there to the left. Ah yes, right there to the left. It's the tour. I think they're posted on the bulletin board, but I haven't checked yet either. Hey, hey. last night. Don't tell anyone what you saw. You mean the fact you own a gun? See you later. Do you mean the fact you own a gun, Yukari? Class F, F's in chat. Uh... Yeah, do you see? Every man must have the passionate samurai spirit within him. At our school, we encourage our students to think like samurai in order to accomplish great things. That's fantastic. The teachings of Bushido are important then as they are now. Yes, yes, you may not be a native of this land, but the spirit of the samurai flows in you just the same. They seem to be having fun. I just don't think a school would let a guy just wear a samurai helmet. Oh, yes, I am. Beeper Yarrow! Yes. Wow, 
You've lived in a lot of different places. I have. Let's see. In 1999, that was what, 10, 10 years ago? Your parents... Died. I'm sorry. I've been so busy, I didn't have time to read this beforehand. They died. You want to talk about my dead parents as soon as I freaking walk into the room? So let's see. You've lived in a lot of places, and I wonder why. Let's see. Oh, yes, your parents are dead. I'm if you'd even looked at that page for five seconds, you'd have seen it. Nice to meet you. We could use more go getters like you. I am a go getter. Pepiato. Have you seen the classroom assignment? You're in two F. F and chat. But first, we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. I wonder if Americans have assembly like this. We have assembly. But I don't think I ever see like in the new school year. In TV shows, Americans having assemblies. We call them assemblies, but yeah. If a job's worth doing, it's worth doing well. When applied to student life, this means This man has no eyes. You can hear the students around you whispering something. Got a transfer student. Yes, that's me. Yep. I've seen her too. She came to school with Yukari. Please don't say it like that. I hear talking. Thank you, old grumpy teacher. I believe it's someone in Ms. Toriyumi's class. Shh. Be quiet. You're going to get me in trouble. It doesn't seem like the rumors will stop anytime soon. What, that I'm a transfer student or that I came in with Yukari? Homeschool's over! Your first after school session is about to begin. Sup? <laughs> you look like a deer in headlights. No, I don't. I look like a magician bunny. You look like a baseball jock. Me? I'm Junpei Iori. Nice to meet you. I transferred here when I was in eighth grade. I know how tough it is being the new kid. So I thought I'd check up on you. Make sure you weren't freaking out on your first day. I uh, know. At it again, huh? Honestly, is there any girl you wouldn't hit on? Did you ever think you might be bothering someone? What? <laughs> but I was just being friendly. He actually was just being friendly. This time, anyway. anyway some coincidence that we'd be in the same homeroom. Just <laughs> Yukari just walks in the room. She's like, Junpei, do you have better things to be doing than talking to classmates? <laughs> Junpei, seriously. I'm glad to have a friend. What a bitch! Never mind, Yukari. Yeah, I, I'm glad we ended up in the same class too. You don't have to lie, Yukari. Hello. Hi, Junpei. Get I'm in this class too. Come on, let me in on the fun. No, Yukari's already decided, Junpei. You don't get to talk to classmates. Now sit in the corner. By the way, you guys know each other? Yes. I heard you two came to school together this morning. Yes. A couple of cuties like you walking side by side. <laughs> the whole class was buzzing about you. Ugh, could you just cut it out? I hate dealing with rumors like that. What's the rumor exactly? That the two of us came into school together? That's an odd thing to start a rumor as. I mean, I'm used to it, but she just got here, you know? Don't I you did. Feel bad spreading rumors like that? It's not really a rumor. Well, I've got to go take care of some archery team stuff. Don't try anything funny. You got that, Junpei? What is she, your nanny? She's my friend. Well, she was until she was a bitch about it. I seriously didn't come over here to hit on you or anything. That's fine. If you ever have a problem, you can tell your old pal Junpei about it. And I will. <laughs> cool. Well, I'll be seeing you around then. Probably we're in the same class. Whoa. Check out the jocks on the run. Hey, did anyone tell you about the school clubs yet? Girls can join too, so why not do it if you're interested? Girls can join too? Is that just- okay, I remember now that Junpei- I remember this was a weird thing at the beginning of the game. You'd be joining as a new member though, so you won't be able to apply for a little while. I made small talk with Junpei on my way back. Cause he's been nicer to me than Yukari has. <laughs> Cause I told Yukari she was my friend and she was weird about it. Welcome back. Thank you Mitsuru. You really shouldn't be outside on your own at night. It's too dangerous. You must be tired. You should get another night's rest. Why are you, Morgana? Oh, hi. What are you doing? Just looking around. There's nothing much to see. You're probably tired, huh? You should get to bed early tonight. All right. Everyone wants me out of the way. Are 
A young man walked down the stairs as Mitsuru was reading a book. I'm going out for a bit. Hmm? Have you seen the newspapers lately? I know. People who had no problems before are suddenly developing acute cases of apathy syndrome. I've seen it in the news quite often lately. They say it's due to stress, but... Yeah, right. It has to be them. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. You have a one-track mind. Will you be okay on your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. Practice of what? It's not the midnight hour this yet. Isn't a game, Akihiko. Yay! Did you hear the rumor? Oh, um, something about a bathroom? N no Not that one. I mean the story about the first year student. Not only did she stop coming to school, she does nothing but sit and stare at the walls all day. Mood. If her mother tries to talk to her, she only mutters to herself, it's coming, it's coming. Hmm, how about that? You don't believe me? No. Because your story sounds implausible and also you just, you were very vague. Open up your textbooks and we'll take a look at the first novel by Zenzo Kasai. Oh, why him? I'd rather teach Utsubo Kubo, Utsubo Kubota. He became famous as a singer, but he's also produced fine literature. I wonder why it's not in the textbooks. Next time I'll just bring in a Kubota book. Hey Junpei, were you listening? Who did I say my favorite author was? It's about Kubota. That's right, so you were listening to me after all. Well, you know how I like to pay attention. I don't think that's true, Junpei. May you save my bacon. Peppa gave him the answer. She must pay attention in class. I did not. I have ADHD, but you know. And just like that, I'm popular. You know like how people who give the right answer in class are instantly the popular kids? The dormitory lounge. Yukari is already here talking with an unfamiliar man. Hello. So, this is our new guest. Hello, sophisticated gentleman. That's an odd name. Good evening. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chief Shuji Ikutsuki. Ikutsuki. <laughs> Hard to say, isn't it? Hey, Mopa. How you doing? Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to the stream. That's why I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. I apologize about the confusion regarding your accommodations. However, it may take a while longer before you receive the proper room assignment. Is there anything you'd like to ask? Uh, why did you come here? You, of course. Okay, that sounds odd. Which, where's Mitsuru, Yukari? She's upstairs. As diligent as always. Although it doesn't hurt to come down and say hello. Do you have another question? Uh, who else there lives here? Four students in this dorm. You, Yukari here, Mitsuru, and a senior named Akahiko Sanada. I hope you all get along. Do you have another question? You saw I saw something strange. odd. Like what? You were probably just tired. <laughs> I, I love it. Uh, before you even remotely began talking about it, you were tired. You were very tired that night. I wasn't even here, and I can tell you were tired. Do you have another question? No. I you have a successful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me, you must be tired from all Oh my god. You should go to bed. You are definitely tired. The early bird catches the bookworm. I don't think that's the phrase. Please forgive the bad pun. <laughs> I also don't think that was a pun. <laughs> You'll get used to his lame jokes. That wasn't a joke. The early worm catches the book. The early bird catches the bookworm. Coyotes. Very famous to have coyotes in Japan. Working hard? So, how's she doing? She went to bed a little while ago. She's a Very tired. I get that. I only had a few hours sleep last night. Mr. Chairman, do you think she's Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Spooky. Meanwhile, back in Tatsumi Port Island. Upbeat music is playing from the radio that the man threw away. Spooky.
啪。Oh, it's London. What the? What's happening to me? See, I told you it was a scary game. Back at a certain room in the dormitory. Hmm. She's still sleeping. The dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the hidden hour. During this time, an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin. That's a word you made up. To all that occurs. Then she must be... As you can see, she's retained her... Too spoopy for me. <laughs> she's asleep, but she's definitely experiencing the dark hour. So do I. The only question that remains is whether or not she has the potential. Although she must. If she didn't, they would have preyed on her by now. Scary. In any case. See, Yukari thinks it's a scary game too. For a few more days. Yes, sir. I feel kind of bad though, spying on her like this. Master, Master Pepiato. Oh, I have to choose who to date. That's gonna be really hard for me. <laughs> There's like three guys in this game I like to date. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Hello, Igor. My name is Igor. I am delighted. I love this man. Your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. Henceforth. You shall be welcome here in the Velvet Room. You are destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my help to do so. I only ask one thing in return. Blood. <laughs> and assume responsibility for the choices you make. <laughs> I understand. Thank you. There is still one more resident of this room who unfortunately could not be present for your arrival. Look at the size of that snores. Hey, Igor's just, you know. He's a distinguished looking gentleman. <laughs> but I'll make sure you two are properly introduced. Another time, perhaps. Till we meet again. Okay, Igor. Eagle sounds right. I know, going from... I've been playing Persona 5 in my Discord recently. So going from the Persona 5 in sounding Igor in this to the actual Igor in Persona 3's voice actor, like the original Igor, as it were, from the first four games, is still, like kind of jarring. <laughs> Time to go to school! Yo, man, I'm so sleepy today. In times like these, it's best to sleep during class. You may, you ever notice how sometimes taking a nap in class makes you feel more refreshed than sleeping at home? Uh, don't sleep in class, Junpei. <laughs> what? You don't have to be all serious. That feeling of being completely recharged. I thought I said discharged for a moment. Recharged is awesome, but I'm screwed later if I, since I didn't hear the lecture. Ah, uh, but we have a classic, li classic literature today. That means we're stuck with Mr. Nasty old Ikoda. Ikoda. I'm Mr. Ikoda. I'll be teaching you classic literature. I'll be teaching you about good old Japan all year. Some people say classic lit isn't relevant to everyday life, but oh, they're wrong. The students, the other teachers, wrong, wrong, wrong. Nobody really understands classic lit. I'm gonna stay awake. Hey, are you all listening to me? Wake up, children. Now open your textbooks. First on our syllabus is Issei Monogatari, the origin of Japanese literature. It's a very interesting story. You youngsters might call it Da Bomb. We would not. But this game was released in like 2009, so I guess they would call it Da Bomb back then. 
I can tell you people are zoning out. What would we call it these days? The Riz? Riz is the hot shit at the moment. Top, top tier? <laughs> you call it top tier. <laughs> You meet Yukari at the shoeboxes and decide to go back together. Palomi Palonia Mall. <laughs> cool, you unlock the part of Resident Evil where, <laughs> where you go to school <laughs> and get your persona. I love that part. It's my favorite part too. Karaoke. I know it's kind of how it's supposed to be said, but. You say that. I'm going straight in the nightclub. Thank you. Peppy, you're stinky. Hey! I had a shower this morning. Welcome back. The moon is beautiful tonight. Skida. Skida ne? It might be, be it might be nice to read a book by moonlight once in a while. Or go to bed, because that's what you're all gonna tell me to do. These network computers were installed when the dorm was built. Their main purpose is to send school reports about daily life here at the dorm. Are you able to stream Persona now? I think to a certain point. But I will say that Persona are actually sponsoring streams because Callie from Hololive actually did a sponsored Persona 3 stream today. Who are you gonna date? Oh my god, I was just thinking that. So I've got three options. I can do Akihiko, Shinji, or Theodore. Those are the three options I normally go for. Sometimes I date all three, because in Persona 3 it doesn't matter if you date multiple people. I used to be a dorm mother here to do stuff like cooking, but now that's just our students. It'd be great for, to have someone doing stuff like that for us, you know. Don't you think? Yeah, right. I mean, I'm not a good cook, and Mitsuru-senpai just doesn't do things like that. You know, if you're handy around the kitchen, I bet you could really do something with this place. Where's the kitchen? This is the kitchen, right? That's the ladies' room. That's the men's room. Yeah, this is the kitchen. If only I could be gay. Oh, I know. I feel like it's so, so harsh that you can't be gay in this game. <laughs> so I'd love to be able to date Mitsuru. Here's a good bit. Wow. At a certain dorm room in the dormitory. How is she? The same as last night. Hmm. Very interesting. They have cameras in my bedroom. Even those who have the potential tend to be unstable at first. Memory loss, disorientation. But this subject is rather unique. She hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. But we're treating her like a guinea pig. Yes, we are watching me sleep. I understand your concern, but it's imperative that we recruit new members. And screw public safety and privacy. <laughs> I heard she's in your class. Wouldn't you be more comfortable working with someone from the same grade? A female classmate at that. A famale. Yeah, I guess. But still. <laughs> Watching Pepper sleep sounds very charming. I don't think it is. I hope you don't snore. I don't, but I do sleep talk. So enjoy that. Command room. Is that you, Akihiko? You're not gonna That's what she said. It's chasing me. I wanted to let you guys know. I'm almost there. Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? I think so. Let's suspend our observation for now. We'll prepare for battle. Right. Be careful. Someone should wake me up. Akihiko. I'm all right. 
Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. This is no time to joke around. It's one of them, Akihiko? Yes, but not an ordinary one. We're being very vague. What the? You've got to be kidding me. Mr. Chairman, please head for the... I only have $5 until the end of the month, so no Persona 3 portable for me. Aw, I'm sorry to hear that. Go upstairs and wake her up. Then escape out the back. We'll stop it here. You let it to us, Akihiko, so I'm afraid you'll have to fight. Like I had a choice. What are you waiting for, Yukari? Go! I'm going! Should you go check outside? Let's go take a look. Wake up! Sorry, I'm coming in. Yukari! I know, I said I was upset that you said I wasn't your friend, but we can... We can talk. Take this. Okay. I love that she just hands me a Naginata. Which if you don't know what that is, it's a massive spear with a blade on the end. <laughs> like, why do you have one of these? Hello? Do you read me? Hello? Yes, I hear you. Be careful. There's more than one enemy. The one we're fighting isn't the one Akihiko saw. What? I would use the green steam. I feel bad for doing that with this kind of game. The green steam? Do you mean Xbox? It's getting... Keep moving, hurry. Oh, torrent. Yeah, I know what you mean. The door's locked. I think we're safe for now. Spooky. You gotta be kidding me. I climbed up the wall? Climbed up the wall? I don't know why she says that like that. Roof, that gigantic shadow. Just what is it we're dealing with? A gigantic shadow. Hey, he just said it. Uh, chotto, chotto mate. Sure you can. Here goes. I have no idea what I think. If I just saw someone, like, just be like, I can fight them. And then put a gun to their head, just be like, I don't think you know what fighting means. I think I think you and I have very different ideas of what fighting means. I do wish there was a female MC version of that scene, because the actual cat scene is really good. I, I am thou. From the sea of thy soul. Is that just Izanagi? Oh, the... Okay. If you play the Persona 3 cutscene, it makes a lot more sense. Because what happens is... He sees Yukari put the gun to her head, and then hers gets knocked away, and then Pharos, which is the blue child, puts his head... puts it to his head, like a um, finger gun to his head. And says, can you do it? Or something along that line. And then the main character does it, and then he pulls the trigger. It's It makes a lot more sense when that scene plays. Opius, if you're a girl... Yes, oh, you get a different Orpheus. It's gold! I actually quite like the girl design. They didn't have to redesign Orpheus, but they did, and I like that they did. It's still moving. I guess it's because most personas match the gender you are. Yeah, I do hate that 
uh, Ophius kind of sucks. I thought I had access to Aggie already. Oh, but I guess I have... Oh, okay, it's the same kind of attack. I love the female protagonist's boss music. There's kind of a character like that. Not in Persona 3, but in one of the Persona games. There's a, a girl character that has a boy Patrona, uh, a boy persona. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> oh, I already, oh, I get Aggie now. Team Dukari is safe too. You feel exhausted. You're losing consciousness. Grimax! Hello, 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 hello. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> Please, can you hear me? <laughs> Answer me! In one or two? I haven't played either of those. No, I said in one of the Persona games. I'll just say, it's in Persona 4. I have played one or two though. You should probably play two. Two's very good. Both of the two games are good. It's so nice to see you again. Hi, Eagle. You became unconscious after awakening to your power. I'm aware. I see that it was Orpheus that heeded your calling. Yes. That power is called a persona. It is a manifestation of your psyche. A persona is a facet of your personality that surfaces as you react to external That's a yes. I'm not sure 100% if... Hmm. You can think of it as a mask that protects you as you brave many hardships. When That's what Orpheus is? Persona ability, you must channel your inner strength. Channel my inner strength. It evolves as you develop your social links, your emotional ties with others. The stronger your social links, the more powerful your persona ability. All right, well, <laughs> can't. <laughs> marches on in your world i shouldn't keep you here any longer next time we meet you will you come, come here, here of your own accord Until then, then farewell. bye eagle and then i slept for two weeks persona 3 has some has a real nasty habit of doing that where it's like and then nothing happened for two weeks there's actually i hate kind of hate the end game of this game because there's a moment in this game where you kind of can't do anything for, for a few weeks. Your head is getting clear. You wonder how long you've been asleep. You feel someone's presence beside you. Awake. Hey, it's my not friend. Uh, how do you feel? Thank goodness you finally How long have you been here? <laughs> I was so worried about you. I understand that. So how long have you been here? The doctor couldn't find anything wrong with you. He said you were just exhausted. Sleepy. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't do anything. But your power, You should be. It was amazing. I'm aware. You mean the shadows? They're what we're fighting against. And the power you used, we call it Persona. Well, that's convenient because that's what Ego calls it too. <laughs> Imagine if Ego's like, we call it Fliggity Floggity. And then she's like, we call it Persona. It's like, I think one of you has come up with the cooler name. I wanted to tell you that I'm sort of like you. A, a person? A girl? A high school student? A Persona user? My dad died in an accident when I was little. We call it Stand. <laughs> my mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. And you're all alone too, right? To be honest, I already know about your past. Oh, good. But it didn't seem fair, so I wanted you to know about mine. It was back in 99. There was a big explosion in the area. Supposedly, my dad died in the blast. 
but nobody really knows what happened. He died in the blast. <laughs> he was working in a lab run by the Kirijo group. So, I'm hoping that if I stick around long enough, I'll find out something. That's why I'm going to Gekukan High, and why I was there when this happened to you. Of cool course, story, bro. It wasn't much help. It was my first time fighting them, too. Yeah, but I'm not gonna lie. Um, Yukari, it was my first time starting fighting them. I didn't even know what they were, but I did a better job than you. You wouldn't have to go through all this if I wasn't such a coward. You wouldn't travel to Louisiana to meet your wife. I was scared too. Yeah, I couldn't chicken out, otherwise we'd have died. Yeah, you can you can really, go now. I thought to myself, I've been hiding so many things from her. As soon as she wakes up, I'll tell her the truth. So thanks for listening. You're welcome. I've been wanting to share that story with someone for a long time. Alright. I'm gonna get going. I'll let the others know you woke up. Cool story, bro. Oh, and uh you don't have to be formal around me or anything. Wasn't intending on being. A second your girls got to stick up for each other after all. Bye. Bye, Yukari-chan. <laughs> Yo, long time no see. What's up? Did you have an upset stomach? Yes, Junpei. I had an upset stomach. And then I was off for two weeks with the upset stomach. What the fuck do you think? Anyways, I got, I got something to tell you. What is it? Actually, oh wait, I'm not supposed to say anything. Sorry, man. <laughs> that's, how I'm, that's how I'm interpreting chuckling. Sheesh, someone's full of energy today. I can hear you from all the way over here. Hey, it's Yucatan. You two live in the same dorm, yet came separately today. Is it because you'll cause too many rumors again, hmm? What? I just left a little late. Anyways, I need to talk to her. Bye-bye, Junpei. What? You feeling better? Pepper. Peeper. Sorry to hit you this first thing in the morning, but Ikutsuki-san says he wants to talk to you tonight. Come to the fourth floor of the dorm after school, okay? Don't forget. That's right. Junpei is not going to be your best friend because you're a girl and that's not right. Yeah, no, he has that weird stuff with like being like, I, I should be the leader because I'm a man and they're girls. <laughs> it's just like, imagine trying to pull that shit in front of Mitsuru. <laughs> That's enough about mammoths. I don't see what the big deal is. They're just huge elephants. And that wraps up the Stone Age. Ugh. Tired of these lessons about stones. Rather talk about the Sengoku era. Japanese history is not that exciting until then. Though I'm paid to do this, so I've got a... It's tough being an adult. Big mood, Mr. Ono. Next is the Jomon period. When do the samurai get their day in the sun? This guy's like, just like... I became a history teacher to teach one era of history and nothing else. <laughs> I just ask a question at random and call it a day. Hey, Junpei, what was the style of houses in the German period called? Uh, how am I supposed to know about something back then? Quick, Pepper, what's he talking about? They were elevated houses. They weren't. Mr. Ono is the original otaku. He's just like... He has that one thing, and I, I respect him for having that one thing. You were told to go to the fourth floor. I was. Ah. A room on the fourth floor. Yukari, Mitsuru, the chairman, and unfamiliar male are sitting here. Ah, Even in all this time, I haven't seen Akihiko. I'm glad that you're okay. I wasn't sure what I'd do if anything had happened to you. The reason I asked you here is because I needed to talk to you. Oh, you're a little bit close to the mic there, mate. Please, have a seat. Is Hanamura? Oh, Yosuke? I like Yosuke, too. Oh, before that. I think I prefer Ryuji, but I do like Yosuke. I believe I mentioned him earlier, but this is Akihiko. I Hello, Akihiko. How you doing? Okay, let me start. He's off so cute. You 
Would you believe me if I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours? Imagine opening a conversation like that. I'm just going to do a conspiracy theorist um, stream one day. Where I'm just going to come online and just be like, What's up, chat? So, would you believe me if I think aliens uh, secretly teleport people onto their planet of Zuzi and, like, teach them the ancient alien ways? <laughs> Excuse me. Remember the night you came here? You had to have noticed the signs. The road signs? That's how I got here. Street lights went out. Oh yeah. Nothing was working. There were coffins everywhere. Didn't it feel like you were in a different time? That's the dark hour. Pepper is an alien. <laughs> no. And the next. Uh, what do you define as alien? I guess it's more like something people aren't aware of. But the dark hour does exist. It occurs each night at midnight. It'll happen tonight and every night to come. Yes, that's what each night means. Normal people don't realize it since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. Anything that's not from Earth. Like, are we talking like animals or people? But that's not what makes the dark hour so interesting. You saw those creatures. We call them shadows. Shadows. Here during the dark hour and attack anyone not in a coffin. Akiko's really enjoying this conversation. It's our job to And your beauty is out as well. Thank you. Akihiko, why are what if I do this? Like <laughs> if I try and break my model again. You just got hurt the other day. Break model? No, not that way. That, that. I can break my model basically. <laughs> I've been informed by M Papa to not do that though. Long story short. They may be on human understanding. Oh, then I'm not an alien. We're the specialized extracurricular execution squad, C's for short. On paper, we're classified as a school club, but in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the shadows. <laughs> Mitsuru is the leader. I'm the club advisor. A shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news, if not all of them. How do you fight them? Although rare, there are those who can function during the dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight the shadows. That's me. That's Persona, the power you used the other night. Yes, flimmy goggle. That's what Eagle calls it. Shadows can only be defeated by Persona users, which means it's all up to you guys. I'm glad you're quick to understand. I see. Mitsuru opens the case on the table. A silver gun gleams uncannily what from inside. Is, we want you to join us. And you get a gun. We've prepared an evoker for you. We a gun. All right. I would welcome aboard. Sorry, I skipped your line, Yukari. So much. I'm really glad. Oh, I almost forgot. About your room assignment. Why don't you just stay here in your current room? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> You're a terrible liar. <laughs> Hold up. It was Oh, never mind. You joined C's to fight the shadows. Imagine if you just said no. <gasps> a voice rings in your head. Ah, oh, I miss this music. You don't get it in Persona 5. I love this music. And I have all these tarot cards. <laughs> thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt be blessed when creating Persona cards with the fool. You've established the C's social link of the fool, Arcana. You may earn an XP bonus when fusing Personas of the fool, Arcana. You feel your inner strength growing. You recall what Igor said about the power of social links. The intensity of social links strengthens the power of persona. Social links. Are these the bonds you form when, pe when people you meet? You are still tired from your hospital stay. You decided to return to your room. You want me to fight monsters with the power of shooting myself? Count me in. Exactly. It's just like... I understand. I'll do it. <laughs> I haven't even mentioned anything. Just like, I'll do it. 
Do I get a gun? <laughs> Hello! We've met before. We have! <laughs> Please don't just stand in my room while I sleep and then laugh. Soon the end will come. Cool Remember, story, so bro. I should tell you. <laughs> <sighs> Just appear in the uh You can shoot the enemy in Persona 5. Just appearing in the frickin' thing. Oh in Persona 4. One of the characters in Persona 4 has a gun too. Just being like just so you know, the apocalypse is coming. I thought I should tell you. Of everything, but to be honest, I don't really know what it is. The end of everything? Oh. Looks like you've awakened to your power. I have. And an unusual power it is. A power that takes many forms, yet is bound by ah! It may prove to be your salvation, depending on where you end up. Give me a sec, chat. Do you remember when we first met? I expect you to honor your commitment. My commitment was that everything I did was of my own volition, you, and that I would take responsibility me. for my actions. Goodbye. I'm back. I kind of wish they kept the moon thing off of the screen until you find out about the moon correlation. Morning! Thanks about today. Akihiko Senpai's injured too, and I was really uneasy about working with Mitsuru Senpai alone. Senpai okay? Yeah, Akihiko was. Senpai was attacked a day. By a shadow on the day that you collapsed too. He said that he's injured his <laughs> breathing intensified. His ribs a little. Am I breathing harder now? I took my asthma inhaler so I wouldn't. Yukiko, y Yukiko, Jesus, I'm in the wrong freaking game. Yukari began talking to you in class. I thought I was gonna fall asleep in there. Come to the lounge when you get back to the dorm. I have something to tell everyone. I'll save the details for later. I'm pregnant, and Akihiko is the father. She's probably that was fast. Things like student council. Unlike us. Yukari, do you mind not dripping in jealousy when you say things like that? Ooh, do I sense some hostility? Thank you, Junpei. It seems that Junpei was listening too. A bitch. No, I get it, Yukari. Go on, say it. I want drama in my dorm. About earlier, it's not that I don't like her or anything, you know? Girls always said that to me at school before they said something. For some reason, I didn't have many girlfriends at school. I kind of always hung out with boys because I liked, like, I hate saying it, but like boy things like video games and anime and stuff like that <laughs> and back in back when you know the boomer bunny was at school that wasn't a common thing for people to do so it was getting more popular for sure and there were a tomboy oh yeah I was a tom I was a real tomboy <laughs> and um but I was always because I was like Never in any of the friendship groups of any of the other girls. I always somehow managed to be the one that the girls would come to at school and tell me about their problems. Like, I was always just in class because I used to read a lot. So I used to just sit and, like, if my friend wasn't available, I had, like, one friend at school <laughs> that I was, like, really, really good friends with. And if he wasn't around, I'd just, like, sit in a class and read. And then like, the girls would all come in, they'd be like, Oh my god, I can't believe what Rachel said. And then they'll look at me and be like, Peppa, you know Rachel from class blah blah blah? And I'd be like, yeah. And they'd be like, well, do you know that she's dating blah blah blah? And that I was supposed to be going on a date with blah blah blah, but he never told me he was dating Rachel. And I'd be like, okay. <laughs> and then Rachel would come in the room with her friends and then everyone would go silent. <laughs> Just be so awkward. Oh, I'm talking about Mitsuru Senpai. I understand. Why does Junpei always have to talk about stuff that isn't any of his business, huh? I know. Why do you have to bitch? <laughs> he says it all in the 
creepiest, most perverted way. He's like the poster boy for sexual harassment. Okay. <laughs> I don't think you know what sexual harassment is, Yukari. And I don't think Junpei would be the poster boy for it. You continue to gossip all all the way back to the dorm. Welcome back. Thank you. We were waiting for you. There's someone I want to introduce. Huh? Hey, hurry up. Hold your horses. This is freaking Ah, who would have known that Junpei was moving in with us? <laughs> What's up? Junpei? Why are you here? I know. Yukari. See, again, I think from the experience I've had at school, what would actually happen is that all the girls that had just been bitching about this guy would all look at each other like this. And then we'd all sort of look at each other and be like... <laughs> I remember having only boyfriends in school voice friend in school. A lot of people thought that I was gay for that. That's odd. It's odd. This is Junpei Iori from class 2F. I eventually went to an all-girl school. I moved schools and then I went to an all-girl school and that was very weird for me. He's staying here. You've got to be kidding me. I bumped into him the other night. He has the potential, but he just awakened to it recently. I told him about us, and he agreed to help. Oh. You have the potential? For real? I thought the only thing you had potential for was sexual harassment. <laughs> Junpei, try and... Junpei, try. Try and make that sound slightly less like you were, you know, being pathetic. Man, that's embarrassing. Yeah, why did you tell that story then? Yes, crying like a baby. And crying like a baby. I was okay. No, I was okay. Please don't say us. You've been here for five minutes, Junpei. It'd be nice to have a guy around too, wouldn't it? You don't have to say it like that, Junpei. Uh, yeah. So anyway, glad to join the team. Beeper. You can count on me. I got like two girlfriend, two friend girlfriends on school. I ended up dating both because I was a stupid kid. They couldn't just see a girl as a friend. That's fair. That's pretty okay. I think because I had an older brother and then like we had to stay with like a babysitter who had two sons as well. So I kind of had always been around boys. So I kind of was like always trying to fit in with them, which is why I always did lots of sports and did lots of like boy stuff. <laughs> I was always like, ugh, pink, no, gross. Now I have like pink everything and I'm wearing like sheepy thigh highs and stuff. <laughs> and I've got like cinnamon roll stuff everywhere. But when I was like a kid, I'd be like, oh, pink, no, can't wear dresses, ew, gross. Because my mom was like that too. Well, the oh, okay, sorry. I think we're about ready. But yeah, my mom was also like a tomboy. Okay. Everybody's here. I'd like your undivided attention. For a long time, Mitsuru and Akihiko were the only Persona users we had. Understandable. But that number recently jumped to five. Randomly. Therefore, starting tonight. Therefore, well, we're multiplying. I'd like to commence <laughs> the exploration of Tartarus. Tartarus? What's that? Sounds, Sounds like a soup paste. You haven't seen it, Junpei? Hmm? It's no surprise since it only appears during the dark hour. The dark hour? Just like the shadows. Interesting, Interesting huh? And it's the perfect place for us to train. You can think of it as a shadow net. Have a play for boy. I read superhero. I did read superhero comics. I read mostly DC. My brother read Marvel. And then we'd swap stuff. So he would read my Batman comics. And I would read his Thor comics. 
And then we started swapping eventually where he would also read my Green Lantern comics and I would read his Doctor Strange comics. Whoa. Nest, huh? But Senpai, what about your injury? Uh, my favorite superhero is Green Green Lantern, so. Only come as far as the entrance. Yeah, I know. Relax. I've got your backs. I'm not so sure about this. What about you, Mr. Chairman? I'll stay here. As you know, I can't summon a persona. But you can experience the dark hour. Weird. Gekko Khan High School, Frank Gate. This is it? This is the place? Why here? Just wait a few minutes. It's almost midnight. Akihiko sounds so excited about all these things. He's like, it's almost midnight, baby. <laughs> Are you sure Akihiko's not the poster child for sexual harassment? His voice is very sexual. But only about shadows, which I think means that Akihiko wants to date shadows, which is odd, but I'll allow it. Spooky. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. L labyrinth? What are you talking about? What happened to our school? It turned into Tartarus. Once the dark hour passes, everything returns to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? But why? Why'd our school turn into a giant tower? We don't know. No, either? no. No. We've established this. Knowledge is very lacking on this team. I'm sure it's complicated. Well, very. Maybe now we'll find out. Hopefully. Mitsuru and I have only gone in to take a peek. This will be our first time exploring. I don't want to date Mara. Oh my god, I forgot Mara's in this game. There has to be some sort of clue in here. Am I allowed to show Mara on stream? Akihiko, I respect your enthusiasm, but you won't be accompanying us today. I know. You don't have to remind me. I don't know if I can. Can I? He's like a special boss somewhere on the floor. A few floors up, I think. Like a few tens up. It's just as cool on the inside. It's very cool. I like the Tartarus design. It sure is creepy. This is only the entrance. The labyrinth lies beyond the doorway at the top of the stairs. First, we'll have you three get a feel for this place. You can, but only the necessary time not overextending it. Maybe, yeah. Look around. It might be that when that happens, I might have to throw something on screen. What? By ourselves? We're not asking you to go very far, and I'll be feeding you information from here. We're also going to Yay. to make any necessary decisions. For real? One of us? Oh, oh, me, 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 pick me. No, Junpei. You're in charge. Yay. She's a girl. And I'm a magician. Well, she has fought them before. Mm -hmm. Seriously? Yes. That's true, but there's another reason. You two. Can you summon your persona without any difficulties like she can? Yeah, of course I can. I think so. These are shadows we're talking about here. Without your persona, you're screwed. I'm aware of that. All right, let's head inside. Are you ready? You betcha. That's the spirit. Ow. I think I just made myself bleed. I'm fine. What's the matter? <gasps> I'm going into the velvet room, BRB. <laughs> That's what I should call going to the bathroom. I've been waiting for you. Igor, why does everyone sound like they're trying to hit on me in this game? <laughs> the time has come for you to wield your power. The tower that how did it come to be? For what purpose does it exist? Uh, regrettably, you are not yet capable of answering these questions. Nope. That is why you must be made aware of the nature of your power.
Your power is unique. It's like I know they're very specific about how you just zone out for a while and everyone's just like Here you go buddy possibilities. You are able to possess multiple personas and summon them as needed. Yay. You have defeated your enemies. You will see the faces of possibility before you. There may be times when they are difficult to grasp. But fear me. Is what you have your power will grow accordingly. Be sure to keep that in mind. Well, though. My spare time will soon be scarce. But please, come again of your own accord. I'll tell you then about my true role. Ah, but before I forget, do you recall when I mentioned another resident of yes, this Yes, I do. Tell me, when you think of this person, what do you see? I think it's a man. I think his name is Theodore. Then let's bring him out for a proper introduction. My name is Theodore. I love Theodore! Feel free to call me Theo. Oh, I will. Theo. Theo! Yeah! <laughs> if chat ever needs to know my type, Theodore is my type. My assistant will aid you as well. I'm sure he will. Until then, farewell. Can I go talk to Theodore again, please? I would like to. Hey, are you all right? Yeah, what's up? You look like a zombie. That's what you picked to dwell on? Oh, I get it. You're trying to yank my chain here. Yes, underling. Be quiet. Your leader is speaking. Whenever you need it, man. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Come on, let's go. Wait, where's Elizabeth? Well, you don't have to choose Elizabeth. Elizabeth is not best waifu because Theodore is here. So, this is it, huh? I hope I don't get lost. Can you all hear me? Yes. Whoa, is that you, Simpai? I'll be providing audio backup from here on out. And your type is emo boys. Oh, it's kind of not. It tends you? to be um, well spoken. Theodore's best waifu. <laughs> It tends to be like well-spoken guys who seem kind of emotionally cold, but they'll be there for you eventually. I'd like to join you, but the really, my first husbando in anime was uh, Kyoya Senpai from Orin High School Host Club. That's why outside support is imperative. Well, that makes me feel a whole lot better now. Based on your current location, you can expect to encounter enemies at any minute. They shouldn't be too tough. Practice makes perfect. Right. Got it. Why is she always like that? What a bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to play the game. Snuff soul. Damn it. That was terrible. No thanks. So you like Kudere boys. Girls don't use swords. No, they don't. No, girls use Naginatas. Which, to be fair, I think are cooler. That's all right. Whatever you're telling me, I order now. The enemy is vulnerable. Keep nice. going. I summon you. I love this song. Print all out attack. I always find it so odd that the female main character's eye color changes to brown in her battle stuff. Despite the fact that she clearly has red eyes, like, all other times. Because red-eyed girls are the cutest girls. Oh, 
Like, why everyone has to use- I know, it's cool. Would you like to That's not necessary. I have a lot of starting SP. You the enemy's weak and HP, actually. Orpheus! You struck the enemy's you. Why is what the sword thing was weird? Because Junpei also uses a sword. <laughs> Bad stuff. <laughs> nice. Shuffle time! I do miss shuffle time. I kind of was missing that in uh, Persona 3. But he's a ninja frog. Disco Ninja Frog. Also, fun fact. Um, if you've never played Persona before, Persona 3, if you hang out on one floor of Tartarus for too long, um, if you hang out on one floor for too long, Reaper will appear. So you kind of have to keep moving up. Until you're strong enough to take care of Reaper. And your navigator will be like, I sense death! And you can hear the rattling of the chains and stuff. They actually told you not to stay in one room for too long? Interesting. I mean, it's better to just explain why you shouldn't stay in one for too long, though. Wiping all out. You can't fool my magician eyes. I'm great at shuffle time. Game looks so smooth. It does look smooth, doesn't it? The upscaling on this game looks so good. Like, look, look how cute everyone looks. How do I do that again? Oh, they're saying to split up. Everyone, spread out and proceed individually. Let's return to the entrance. But yeah, it looks really nice and smooth. It seems we returned to the entrance. Welcome back. So, how was it? I see. Well, if you gained confidence, that's the best thing you could have Great achieved. confidence comes great confidence. Wow. I never knew I had that kind of power. But damn, I'm beat. That's because you were bouncing around like a little kid. Yeah, you look pretty tired yourself. You. I'm still trying to catch my breath, actually. That's the effect of the dark hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. Don't worry, though. You'll adapt. Yay! But I'm surprised. You all did much better than I expected. Yay! Mitsuru gave us a compliment. Great, they'll catch up to you in no time, Akihiko. <laughs> we'll see about that. Akihiko, you could just take the take take the W. By combining your powers with your teams, you are able to stand against the shadows. You feel a bond forming between yourselves. <gasps> you felt the power of your heart intensifies if the reaction to the bond between your friends. Bomb. Rank up! You decided it'd be best to return to your dorm room! Yay! And also save the game! I don't know why I save so frequently. I think because nothing upsets me more in a JRPG than losing progress. Uh, he fuses personas, basically. Hi, Theodore! <laughs> 
I can't fuse Necromata yet. Oh, and there's no real point in getting rid of Orpheus for Angel yet. Ooh. Yeah, basically, don't get attached to early personas too much. They're basically like fusion fodder. <laughs> I'm trying to remember how early I can get my favorite persona in this game. I think it's pretty early on. Because my favorite persona in this game is Black Frost. It's kind of my favorite persona in general, anyway. But, thing, man, things have been crazy the last couple of days. Are you alright? You must be confused since you traveled, since you've just transferred here, too. <laughs> of course you are. I want to say that I'll take, you, take over your position, but I can't. Man, I'm so bored. I feel like I'm dying. I can't believe that Pepper is the most popular streamer in her house. That's insane. I don't know. I feel like if I put a live stream up on my cats. They would probably be more popular than me. <laughs> Tundra and the Apollo are pretty cute. They're definitely more popular than me on Twitter. I often think about streaming my fish tank too. So she did get elected. What a bitch for getting elected as student president. The position she's clearly okay to do and absolutely no reason to assume otherwise. Yeah, I guess she is the most popular girl in school. Really? You can say that again. There's like some kind of aura. Junpei, read the room. Besides, this school's owned by the Kirijo group, right? I'm thinking about buying a burp. Bubs are great, but they're really, um... What's the term I'm looking for? They bond really strongly with their owners. I've always looked into getting, like... If I was going to get a bird... And bear in mind, I live opposite the road from a macaw. I would not get a macaw. That thing screams. Um... Green cheek connors are really cute. And really easy to look after in bird terms they still need like a lot of attention but like as I begin my term as student council president but they cute share with you my vision for this coming year it is my firm belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our school however change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented but she's in park and um cockatiels I like my babysitter used to have a cockatiel. That is why we must restructure our daily lives. Because he used to play with it. <laughs> I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions to imagine a bold new. They're very smart though. Losing sight of the realities around you. That is the key. I'm certain that many of you have your own visions of the future. For us to reap the full benefits of our education, your participation, ideas, and enthusiasm. I have all of those. Thinking about cockatoo. Was freaking amazing. Hey, did you understand what she was talking about? Huh? Seriously? Man. Imagine listening to a speech where they're like, "Well, yeah, green cheek connors are like." Um, they're like parakeets, so like little baby parrots. Sure didn't sound like something a high schooler would say. If it was anyone else, we'd be laughing our asses off. But it's Mitsuru, and she's hot, and Yukari hates her. <laughs> All right, today we'll be going over Meiji era literature. Open your page books to page twelve. Your page books to twelve. You know what? I'm tired of these textbooks. I just went over this novel in the last class. I've got a great poem we can cover instead. Close your textbooks and everyone listen. Isolated cloud suspended over the tall snowy mountain peak. All right, Kenji, you better not be sleeping back there. You should be ashamed of yourself taking a map while I pour my heart into this reading this poem. For that, you get another essay along with your regular assignment tonight. I'll expect a slice of cake when you turn it in too. Don't cheap out with the store bore stuff like last time. She's just asking for cake? She's 
She's just asking for cake from students. I don't know if that's okay. On Mondays and Fridays, I think Yakihiko is here for his social link. Oh yeah, I forgot I can actually like buy stuff. Wait for us. Oh yeah. Swarming Akihiko Senpai like that. I know he's the captain of the boxing team, but I mean, come on. You don't even see girls flock like that on TV. I wonder where they're going. Did anyone actually ever have a hey, can you move the mouse? Has that been on screen this entire time? Has that been on screen the entire time? Huh? Who? Us? I Oh, can you move with the mouse? I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. Maybe you can click with the mouse. Where it is, right? I'll see you there. The, the police station? Uh, are your friends gonna come along too? Who, these girls? With the mouse. <laughs> ah. I don't even know their names. They talk so much they give me a headache. Anyway, I'm gonna head out. Don't keep me waiting. I literally don't know anyone who was... Why can't he be more friendly? I literally don't know anyone who was popular in school. We gotta go. Sheesh. Talk about putting a damper on a guy's afternoon. Let's go to the police station. Uh, yeah, I can click with the mouse. Um. Let me see. Ah, oh, I can move with the mouse. Oh, that's weird. You, like, hold down the mouse and then you move with it. Or I guess you can just click with it as well. Those are the popular boys. I don't think I was. I wasn't really that popular. Like I said, I only had like one really good friend. Wee. Thank you, sir. I never felt like da 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 da. Never feel me. Ba -da 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 -da. I love this song. This is Officer Kurosawa. Like da 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 da. And this is from Ikutsuki san. Really? Sweet! You can't fight empty handed, so find something you like. Officer Kurosawa has connections. What connections? Oh, these things still cost money. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. I realize that. Well, I'll see you later. Hello. I've been informed about you too. My job is to maintain peace in this city, regardless of the circumstances. I'm just an ordinary police officer, but it doesn't take a genius to know something strange is going on here. I'm only doing what I, I think is right. And that's arming teenagers, because I think that's the right thing to do. Do, 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 do. Peeper. I was gonna buy stuff for other people, but then realized if I die, everyone else dies. Ah, <sighs> oh, crap. I have to buy shoes as well. What accessories do I have access to? Spirit ring. Hmm. 
You're in a bad mood. I can't wait to get a job. I can now go out at night. But I think that's where I'm going to call it for tonight because I've technically been streaming for nearly three hours now. Thank you for joining me today, though. I've really enjoyed my time. I'll have to look into streaming more Persona at some point. And never streaming Resident Evil again. Because I couldn't make it through the prologue. So that's always good. And hopefully chat will never ask me for anything ever again. Or more specifically, will never ask me to do something like a, uh, a horrors game again. But thank you everyone, join me on Saturday. And remember, if you are in my Discord, you can join my Minecraft server, which will be sorted out. That is That was being worked on today, so. But thank you for joining me, good night. Good night, good night, good night, good night, good night. Thank you.